Get up. Even earlier than usual, Doc. I'd like to get this over with as quickly as possible. If you say so. Don't be so glum, Mr. Miles. Today is a historic day. One that will be remembered for years to come. Remembered by some of us, anyway. You asshole. Good morning, everybody. I'm Foxy K, and welcome back to Assassin's Creed. This may be the last episode of the first Assassin's Creed, and I'm so excited! <clears throat> I'm so freaked out about everything. Ah, oh, it's cool. Uh, last time we managed to stop the war and kill the Sabu, one of our last targets, and we revealed that this real mastermind behind everything all the nine that we have to kill, all the trouble in the Holy Land comes from our own master, Al Mualim, and Stop he... Stop screwing around and lie down on the animus! Let me talk, will ya? Thank you. And he will be our last great target to kill, so that uh, Tempered Treasure won't get in the wrong hands, and let's see what's happening. And we also noticed that uh, Lucy is a fellow Templar. She reached herself to us. So, let's drop right in and see where it's going. Use free running to escape from a fight when exposed. Sprint to lose your enemies and jump through merchant stands to avoid the crowd. What happened here? Where is everyone? Gone to see the master. Was it the Templars? Did they attack again? They walk the path. What path? What are you talking about? Towards the light. Speak sense. There is only what the master shows us. This is the truth. You've lost your mind. You too will walk the path, or I you think will he's perish. Really so the master commands. It was El Mualim, wasn't it? What's he that done to you? Praise be to the master, for he has led us to the light. Yeah, whatever. We already in Mathiaf and uh, have no strongness anymore. Yeah, that's a but uh, it's a good way that you don't have to see me riding again, isn't it? So let's see what's going on. Is the on. light? Is the way? Yeah. Uh, sure. Let's get up here. All these. Zombie civilians, pastors. I don't think it will the be world easier. will be cleansed. We will begin anew. I like the world as we was before, and I don't need a new world. Thank you. But I don't think it will be easy to get in there. Alright. <clears throat> Here, you know. 
and I won't die here. Kill the traitor! 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 Kill. Oh, friends and brothers. So, what's going on? Oh, they're running. Yeah, yeah. friend, brother. There you are. Can I have some story maps, please? You know, for reasons. You picked a fine time to arrive. Yeah, so it seems. Guard yourself well, friend. Al Mualim has betrayed us. Yes. Betrayed his Templar allies as well. How do you know? After we spoke, I returned to the ruins beneath Solomon's temple. Robert had kept a journal, filled its pages with revelations. What I read there broke my heart. But it also opened my eyes. You were right, Altair. All along, our master has used us. We were not meant to save the Holy Land, but deliver it to him. Told you. He must be stopped. Be careful, Malik. What he's done to the others, he'll do to us given the chance. You must stay far from him. What would you propose? My blade arm is still strong and my men remain my own. It would be a mistake not to use us. Distract these thralls then. Assault the fortress from behind. If you can draw their attention away from me, I might reach Al Muallam. I will do as you ask, Dai. The men we face. Their minds are not their own. If you can avoid killing them. <laughs> yes. Please avoid killing Though he has betrayed the tenets of the Creed, it does not mean we must as well. I'll do what I can. It's all I ask. Safety and peace, my friend. Your presence here will deliver us both. <laughs> That's a nice sentence. Ah, thank you for the throne, yes. And suddenly, as has the screen turned into something more like Metal Gear, don't kill. So, poor Robert, he lost his diary. In Solomon's temple. I think he was searching for it and quite desperate to get it back. Well, oh, shit. Fuck. Totally forgot about that. So I'm not going back, I'm like going forward. Hello. Surprise! It's my best day! There are so many innocents. I must be careful not to harm them. And may I? May I? Come on. Let me through. So, where do we have to go? What's happening? <clears throat> hey, Master. So, the student returns. I've never been one to run. Uh, never been one to listen, either. I still live because of it. What will I do with you? Let me go. Oh, Altair. I hear the hatred in your voice. Feel its heat. Let you go? Well, that would be unwise. Why are you doing this? I found proof. Proof of what? That nothing is true. And everything is permitted. Okay, this now, was a wrecked. Destroy the betrayer. Send him from this world. And now I'm wrecked. Ah, why do I always pull the loop? Norman knife is Sword. Not so. What is it? What is it? That's the Sabo. That's the what was the name of the Ultra Guard on the ship? 
That's a bunch of kings. He was one of my first targets. The guy who compares his sleeves. He was a real doctor. Come on, come on, get up. All of my old targets once again. Well, Oops, where did I go? I'm not fighting a little hallucination. Oh, I'm not fighting zombies. I don't see what the power to ever is. Really no, 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 no. I shouldn't talk too much when I'm fighting. Yeah, that was nice. And the last one. Can I please change? Oof, oof. Face me! Or are you afraid? I have stood before a thousand men, all of them superior to you, and all of them dead, by my hand! Superior to me? I am well. not afraid. Prove it. What could I possibly fear? Look at the power I command. Yep. Whatever pills I swallowed, it was too much. Uh, it's a typical trouble of the bad guy. Too much talking, too less action. If you wanted me dead, she should have killed me while I'm paralyzed. And I don't like that sword, I don't short one. Uh, and the powers of the apple is really explained what's doing and why it's doing it. Uh, luckily, we invented it! Ah, uh, that's the first one, finally. Not from both sides at the same time. No, 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 and now I'm dead. When you have been exposed, killing some of you. And since exposing will be a trouble, mom. But if you want to be dead, you should. Ouch. If you want to be dead, you should kill me when I'm paralyzed. Not. Give me the chance to defend myself. It's the trouble of most villains, but the lack of a hero. The egocentric comes with bad guys. No, don't you kick me, I'll kick you. We'll see. Ah, oh, come on, Dr. Eager, get up. Why? It's a fucking guy. And yeah, I'm always kicking, punching, another kick and punch. It doesn't serve me. Get up. And that again. Oh, more coffee. Remember to reach out for ledges should you fall. Mm. So good. What the fuck is it? So, now we play like my rules, you know. Come get me, come and get me, come and get me, will you? There you go. That's much better. <clears throat> if I please stop punching and start killing, it would be quite a nice idea. <sighs> oh, it's too early. Oh, come on. Oh, Strap wants to talk with Freya. I'm gonna get up here somewhere. Sounds 
Throwing knives, you know? <clears throat> I kind of lose my target all the time. Finally! And the next one, and another one. Get up, Otto, yeah, get up. Come on. You have to do it. Again. Ladders <coughs> are socially acceptable. First training. And change the sword, please. Thank you. And you need again. And again. And pull me behind me. Yes. Oh. It's less stupid and less free and more successful. Please, I don't want to die once more. And I hate it being surrounded by assholes. And another one. So unfair to get me throw aside at the same time. Alright. Have you any final words? You lied to me. Yeah. You called Robert's goal foul when all along it was yours as well. I've never been much good at sharing. You won't succeed. Others will find the strength to stand against you. This is why, so long as men maintain free will, there can be no peace. I killed the last man who spoke as such. Yep. Bold I did. words, it was fun. boy. But just words. Then let me well, go. Old I'll put man. words into action. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me, Master, why did you not make me like the other assassins? Why allow me to retain my mind? That's a good question. Who you are and what you do are twined too tight together. To rob you of one would have deprived me of the other. And those Templars had to die. So you used me as a tool. But the truth is, I did try. In my study, when I showed you the treasure. But you are not like the others. You saw through the illusion. Illusion? That's all it's ever done. This Templar treasure, this piece of Eden, this word of God. You understand now? The Red That's Sea was wide. never parted. Water never turned to wine. It was not the machinations of Iris that spawned the Trojan War, but this! Illusions! All of them! What you plan is no less an illusion. To but force men to follow you against their will. Oh, is it any no. less real than the phantoms the Saracens and Crusaders follow now? <clears throat> Those craven gods who retreat from this world that men might slaughter one another in their names? They live amongst an illusion already. I'm simply giving them another. One that demands less blood. At least they choose these phantoms. Or do they? Yeah, sure, so Aside from the occasional convert or heretic? It isn't right. Ah, <clears throat> and now logic has left you. In its place you embrace emotion. I am disappointed. What's to be done then? You will not follow me, and I cannot compel you. And you refuse to give up this evil scheme. <laughs> it seems then we are at an impasse. Mm. No, Let's we are again. at an end. I will miss you, Altair. You were my very best student. <laughs> oh, bad guys. Oh, we the same. And why do I have to cross? Sword? Can I please fix the short sword? Come on! Same trouble with all the bad guys. Every time. 
Is all you ever be. You'll and ever be. And talk and talk. Reveal themselves to challenge. Reveal themselves to the good guy and talk and talk instead of simply kill. That's I mean, it's good for the hero and everybody wants to be a hero, but <laughs> And everything, but it's unrealistic and yeah, you know, stories are the same way. It's quite a. Oh, look, look. There's the bad guy being an uh, egocentric, arrogant bastard. Try to show off all that he is. Get all my strong ass at them. Got him. Now it's over. Assassin's Creed is Impossible. over. The student does not defeat the teacher. I say you walk a unmutlak bel kullun mumkin. I have no idea what he's so talking it about. Seems. You have won then. Go and claim your prize. You held fire in your hand, old man. It should have been destroyed. Destroy the only thing capable of ending the Crusades and creating true peace? Never. Then I will. We'll see about that. I apply so my heart to no wisdom and to no madness and folly. I perceive that this also was a chasing of the wind. For in much wisdom is much grief. And he that increaseth knowledge increaseth sorrow. Japan is destroyed. China, India. Destroyed, as you said you would. I. I can't. Yes, you can't, my dear. Indonesia, Canaris, Greenland, Canada, <clears throat> so many dots. That's pretty. Can't, we I can't got move anymore. Got I can't move anymore. that well we've got the map how many at least half a dozen we don't need them all we should assume some amount of decay I can't imagine they'll all still be functioning at least two appear to reside on land masses that no longer exist we'll dispatch teams to each site and determine viability we only need one after all what about the rest collect them let's not leave anything to chance Last thing we need is some damn survivor making trouble for us in the new world. And the assassin? We have what we need. Kill him. Wait. You know how these things work. I doubt we'll be able to walk right in. What's your point? We might need him. His memories. I'd recommend we hold him until we have confirmation that there aren't any surprises waiting for us at the sites. This is a waste of time. You said it yourself. We shouldn't leave anything to chance. Very well. Ensure we have no further need of him, then kill him. Fine. Stop undermining my authority! I just saved your ass. <laughs> Let's go. We've got a lot of work to do. Douchebag. Don't get too comfortable, Mr. Miles. We'll be back for you soon enough. Yeah, whatever. And we'll see. What the hell is that? One is blue, the other one is red. I don't know that. So, I know there isn't anything to click around here. Well, I think it is. Maybe some email or what. <clears throat> but the interesting part is. Uh, 
Like that. Now we have our eagle vision inside of here and Oh my that? god. It looks like is that blood? The hell were they keeping here before me? And what happened to him? What does it mean, I wonder? And here we go. That's it. Of course, of course, it's just a screen. Wow, I like it. I could play it again and again. It's a simple story, it's a simple mechanic. It was a first try to get a game like that going. And it worked. It really worked well, I think, for me at least. And it was a start of a great series. A little bit. Uh, not too much of the regular uh, release of Ubisoft during the time, but it's still a great game and a great series. I love everything about it. And I hope you enjoyed watching me struggle through the first Assassin's Creed and seeing my progress on talking to you guys and making videos and everything and I hope I'll see you on the next next new series, next episode with something new and amazing. I hope I'll be able to do it the way I want to do it. And I also wanna play the other Assassin's Creed games. <clears throat> and so much there are even some Assassin's Creed games I haven't played myself, like Black Flag. I never played it before and Assassin's Creed 3 with Connor? Yeah, I think it's Connor on this third one. Um, I just started for uh, two hours or something and then just stopped because the story was so catching at this point for me personally. But I tried to get it done and to get all the Assassin's Creed games one by one until hopefully this year, at the end of 2017, the next game will come. And I heard it will be about Egypt. I'm excited to see what Ubisoft made it of it. And I'm also excited for the Assassin's Creed TV series that's just planned. And I'm a really big fan of this conflict and um, the, the social problems described like one from thousands of years ago. And it's still kind of accurate. I mean, I wonder if we are able to change very little, but we have to stand up for the mistakes that we make. And it's kind of, for me, uh, I think it's a good thing to teach the next generations. But it's not like, well, it's your fault, it's your fault, and everybody else, and don't want to differ. No. We voted for someone to rule our land, then we have to live with our decision in a way, but we are not forced to live with it forever, we have the power to change it again in a way that we want it. And with the elections in the last month or year, you can say, and what's going on all around the globe at the moment, with all the trouble with North Korea and um, the war in the Middle East and everything. We have the power to change it. And we should use it. Before someone comes and erase our minds and just force us to live his plans. And that's an important message, I think. So thank you for tuning in. Thank you for watching this episode. Thank you for watching Foxy King. I hope I see you in the next video. Until then. Ciao!